How to take your blood pressure at home. High blood pressure is a common condition affecting at least one in five adults, most of whom live in low and middle income countries. Over time, it can damage your heart, brain, and kidneys and shorten your life. Most people feel fine. You won't know you have high blood pressure unless it's measured. Checking your blood pressure at home is easy and convenient. You can find out if you have high blood pressure, track your readings, and can see for yourself how lifestyle changes make a difference. Get a blood pressure device for the upper arm. If you can't afford to buy one, borrow one, or share one among a group of people. To check its accuracy, compare the reading that's taken by the health worker with the reading from your machine. It should be within 10 points. Or check a list of validated blood pressure monitors online. Determine your blood pressure range by checking it twice a day for at least a week and then check it periodically. Take the first measurement in the morning before eating or taking any medications. Take the second measurement in the evening before dinner. To get an accurate reading, avoid eating, drinking and exercising half an hour before you take your blood pressure. Empty your bladder if needed, then sit and relax for a few minutes. Your upper arm should be bare. Sit with your feet on the floor and your back supported. Place the cuff a few finger widths above your elbow at heart level with the tubing over the front of your arm. Your arm should be resting and supported. If your upper arm is large, more than 34 centimeters around, a reading with a normal size cuff will not be accurate. Instead, you can place your cuff on your forearm also at the level of your heart. The forearm method may give a higher reading so subtract 5 from the measurement. Press the button and wait quietly. The first two numbers are your blood pressure. The top number, the systolic, is the pressure when the heart contracts. The second number, the diastolic is the pressure when the heart rests between beats. The last number is your heart rate. Normal is between 60 and 100 beats per minute. Record the date and the reading. A normal blood pressure is less than 120 and less than 80. If the readings are often higher than 130 or 80, as this woman's record shows, it's time to make changes in your lifestyle. For example, get more activity, eat healthier, use less salt, and don't smoke. You have high blood pressure if the top number is 140 or higher, or the bottom number is 90 or higher on a regular basis. If you have diabetes, heart disease, or kidney disease, more than 130 or more than 80 is too high. Bring your record to your healthcare provider. You will probably need to start medication. If your blood pressure is more than 180 or more than 120, it's too high. Rest and check it again. If it remains that high, seek medical care right away. Such severe blood pressure can damage your organs. 
Remember, to trust the numbers, take your blood pressure correctly. Record at the same times of day. If your blood pressure is often 140 or higher, or 90 or higher, see your healthcare provider.